we're going to factor this trinomial by grouping. But first, we have to factor out a greatest common factor that's present in all three of these terms. Watch how the terms break down. 50x to the sixth is 25 times 2 times x to the fourth times x squared. How do I know that? Because x to the fourth times x to the two is x to the four plus two. That's one of the rules of exponents. By the way, four plus two is six. The middle term, 50x to the fifth, is going to equal 25 times two times x to the fourth times x to the one, which is just x. And 8x to the fourth is four times two times x to the fourth. Now it should be abundantly clear that each of these terms contains two x to the fourth. There, there, and there. So, I will pull out two x to the fourth as a common factor, and I'll be left with 25x squared plus 25x plus 4. This right there, 25x squared plus 25x plus 4, is a quadratic trinomial. Now I'm going to factor that, what's in the parentheses, I'm going to factor that by grouping. Here we go. My A number is 25. My B number is 25. And my C number is 4. A times C is 25 times 4, which is 100. 100 equals a number of different numbers, like 1 times 100, 2 times 50, 4 times 25, and 5 times 20. Bingo! That's what we want. 5 times 20. That's 100. And 5 plus 20 is 25, which is the B number. So now I'm going to factor. I'll have 2x to the fourth bracket 25x squared plus 5x plus 20x plus 4. Now, I'm going to group the first two terms, and I group the second two terms, and I'm very careful to leave the plus sign in the middle. And don't forget to write your 2x to the fourth on the outside of the brackets. Twenty-five x squared is five times five times x times x, and five x is five times x times one. There's a reason I'm doing that. Twenty x is. 4 times 5 times x plus 4 times 1. 
and I forgot to change my colors. Oh well, we will keep on keeping on. So on the outside of the brackets, I have 2x to the fourth. On the inside of the brackets, I'll have 5x times 5x plus 1. And over here, I'll pull out a 4 common factor, and I'll have 5x plus 1. And then close my brackets. Now notice that for the expression in the parentheses, 5x plus 1 occurs on both sides of the plus sign. It is the common factor. So we'll have 2x to the fourth times 5x plus 1 times 5x plus 4. And now I'm going to check it. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to FOIL 5x plus 1 times 5x plus 4. First outside, inside, last. That'll give me 25x squared plus 20x plus 5x is plus 25x plus 4. And then I'm going to multiply by 2x to the fourth. We can't forget it was there. And I'm going to distribute 2x to the fourth to the 25x squared to the 25x and to the 4. That will give me 50x to the 6th plus 50x to the 5th plus 8x to the 4th. And that's exactly what I started with, which means that my factorization is correct.